Well, it's Monday. I didn't get out Saturday. I didn't get out Sunday. And I see that girl is over here again. You know, back in my day, the boys had to chase the girls. And nowadays, it seems like the girls is chasing the boys, huh? What's up with that? But since I didn't get out Saturday and I didn't get out Sunday, I figured I better get my butt over to uh, Publix. But I need to go buy some of my canned people. Just in case they got some hanging out, I don't want them think I quit on them. Um, I've been thinking too, guys. I got to come up with something better on my videos. I mean, just how interesting is these little trips of mine, you know, out to Publix and around the neighborhood. I need something else. I need some little some variety um anybody got any ideas <sighs> hmm this is my second cup of coffee today in my in my Indiana cup and fellas I'm gonna tell you what that coffee will be hot at six o'clock. It won't be super hot, but it'll be warm. If it stays in there that long, I think I'll probably drink it all. And I've already drunk one of these full. Well, that, that friend of mine there has got no uh, bag hanging out. So we'll go up here. Let's see, who do I go to next? Um, uh, Miss K could have something out and there's some more box. You know what? These people eat a lot. No, wait a minute. That's the Chewy box. Let me see if there's anything in that. Nope. Nothing in that. Nothing in that. You know, I got to thinking, of course it's too late now. My daughter's already went. She just spent she just spent forty dollars on candies and stuff for um uh, Halloween. I could have got her letting me send that forty dollars to to uh uh, crazy family tube he'd send me up a mystery box and I'd just tell him I'm mainly interested in the candy stuff to pass out hey Miss K how you doing dear you fixing to go somewhere or you no, just Home. I went to my exercise class and to the market. Now I'm gonna come home and do nothing. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. I've been seeing you around. I just one time I went by. I was in the car. You wouldn't recognize me in the car. I hardly ever get in the car. Oh. <laughs> but I had to go get my grandson. You doing all right? Yeah, I'm doing okay for the shape I'm in. <laughs> yeah, there you go. How, uh, you told me how old you were. How old are you? 85. 85. Mm -hmm. I hope I can make it that long. I, actually, I, my goal is 95, but <laughs> I don't know. Well, we, we take what the good Lord gives us. Yeah. So far, I've been more I just want to be around to see my youngest grandson grown up and doing what he's going to do. 
Well, my biggest concern is my daughters because neither one of them have any children, you know, and the one's married, this one I live with isn't. And when I'm gone, they don't really have anybody. We've got a bunch of great nieces and nephews, but, you know, they're so much younger yeah. that they don't bother that. We, they include us with things, but not like you would with the people of your own age. Mm -hmm. So I don't know. But I take one day at a time and... Well, that's about all we can do, well, you know? What, you know, different ones say, how come you're not, you know, because I'm not always crying the blues about stuff. I said, well, I learned to take one day at a time. Can't change tomorrow, it's gone. Tomorrow's, uh, and yesterday, I mean, is gone. Yeah. And tomorrow isn't here yet, so why should uh -huh. I worry about it, you know? So, so you was born in about 1932? 34. 34? Mm -hmm. My math ain't so hot anymore. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. Mine isn't either. All right, dear. I'm going to Publix. I just came from there. <laughs> yeah, I got to get over. I, I had, this is the first time I've been out. I, I, I was out Friday, but I didn't go out Saturday. I didn't go out Sunday. And I got some people that save cans for me, and I need to get by and pick them up so they don't think I've quit on them. Yeah. All right, dear. It was nice talking to you. Yeah, I'll see you later. Okay. I'll see you. I need to. Be careful going down there. Have a good day, Kay. You too. Kay is a nice lady. I like Kay. You know, I I am fortunate. If I wanted a woman in my life. I got a lot to pick from if I wanted to do that, go that route, but I don't really, I don't know if I do or not. I mean, man, sakes alive, a hug, just holding somebody, just would be so nice, like used to. Used to me and my wife, we'd just be sitting around holding hands or hugging or just for no reason. Not trying to get, what do you want to call it, sexy or anything like that. Well, just, just to hold her. Just to, ah. Just wanting, I don't know what to call it, folks. I really don't. I really don't. Uh, yes, I'm going to go to Publix, but I'm going to go by Miss, well, I've done been by two places. I'm going across. I, what is it I want, folks? I mean, is it? I don't know. Just one of them things. Is that a can can? Yeah, it is that. I gotta get it for sure. Oh, put my cup in there. That's going in there. Some lights flashing down there. I ain't going that far down. That's way down there. I see some caution lights too. Hmm. Huh. 
Miss Kay's driving, 85 and driving. Well, what is that over there? A bag of trash. I can't get down there. Well, is there cans out here or they're not cans out here? Is there or ain't there or is there or not? And no cans. Dang, that's unusual. I figured after the weekend he'd have some cans out there. I hope she didn't have them out there and somebody forgot somebody else had got them. Okay. See if I can reach that. Yep. Got it. Drain the beer. Put it in there. I know I can't reach that one. <laughs> I got her. I got you, booger. <laughs> you see that, folks? I reached that. That thing five foot away. <laughs> got it. That's going home with me. <laughs> Oh, Lord. I can know I can't reach that one. That one's eight foot away. That one's nine foot away. There's a bunch down there that's 20 feet away and down a hill. I can't touch it. Uh, folks, I am going to plan to do a live... Oh... Uh, I'm planning on doing a live to for y'all to meet my family, all of them. And I hope it won't be a disaster. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go live on my computer in my studio and then my daughter and here lately, and it just aggravates me no end, here lately I'll be talking about something about my daughter or something, and I'll say my wife. And not only does it aggravate me, it aggravates the crap out of her. How you doing, sir? You sitting here looking all alone. You doing all right? Yeah. Uh, don't you just hate it when you gotta depend on stuff anymore just to get around, just to, like I have to get up, first thing I gotta do is take my pills, take my shot, and remember to do it again in the evening, and if I want to walk somewhere, I can't walk somewhere. I can walk a few feet, but I, I can't. My back don't let me do it, so I have to get on this. Thank God for this. But uh, I guess everybody, well, not everybody. I've seen people up in their 90s and never been to a doctor in their life. Isn't that amazing? Of course, I didn't, have, I didn't start till I hit about uh, 70, I'm 78 now, but it's just one of them things, it's just what you get dealt and you have to deal with it, sure do, I've been seeing them things advertised a lot, I got a big machine at home that helps me sleep, 
I use that, but it's it's that machine's obsolete. I can't afford to get one of them. Medicare. Uh. Medicare. They they would pay for work. Hmm. I. I guess so. Well, heck, as far as that goes, VA might pay for one for me. They, they, uh, because they pay for everything else. They bought this. I believe I'll ask about that. I love how you had that. Huh? I love how you had it. This one here, uh, January, a little over six months. How much does it cost? How much does it cost me? Didn't cost me nothing. Uh, I think it was like thirteen, fourteen hundred dollars, something like that. Um, matter of fact, they maintain it too. You know, like my seat's got to be replaced. They're paying for that, and they already put another set of batteries in. I I wore them batteries out in six months, but the batteries was a hundred. I think a hundred and ten dollars a piece, and there's two of them in it. Yeah. yeah, and they come out and did it because I don't have no way to transport. I don't have a vehicle that I can transport this How thing with. Uh, How do you get home? How do you get home? How do you get home? With this. Are you uh, about a mile. Oh, about a mile. It's got a, it's got a seven mile range on it. So. I can pretty well cover the neighborhood a couple of times, but that but it it eventually got to where the batteries wasn't holding up, and that's when they come out and replaced them. You but hmm. You gotta pay for the battery. No, no, they maintain it. They pay for everything, and if this wears out, they'll get me another one. So I'm thinking about asking them about. About one of those things there to see. But I yeah, I was looking at one this morning. Um I didn't look at the price though, there wasn't no need to. But now I get out with it, I come down here. Usually I'm out once a day, but I had this first day I've been out since Friday. Just didn't fill up snow and didn't want to. But did you did you smoke as a younger person? Yeah, those things do. I've been quit on those for thirty years, so it's a good idea I quit when I did. Good idea I quit when I did. <clears throat> well, I need to go in there and buy me some couple of items. I can still drive, but I would rather come out here on this than drive the car. Because if I'm driving a car, I can't stop and talk to people, you know, and I like it. If you drive, I, you need to lift when you have the car to pick the truck. Yeah. Do what? Take the bus. Oh, you're taking the bus? I used to ride them things. They can, they won't take me on this. Now another one I had that they don't like to get these four wheelers on the bus, but they'll take the one for three wheels. But this one takes up too much room. Yeah, maybe. So that's what they told me. Well, I'm going in the store. I got to get some stuff. Right, take care of nice talking to you, my friend. Ah. Uh. Get my legs hanging out. There we go. Oh boy. Caroline, so it's 
See what Miss Caroline got for me. What? You better be recording. Start that tarnal fool beeping. I don't know. Oh. See what we got. Got a few. They quit putting them in bags. Man. That makes it really hard. But. Oh, crap. Okay, it's getting kind of warm. A few cans for Miss Caroline. Now, I'll go around this way. I didn't have as many people with cans out as I thought there would be. I surely thought Miss Ashley would have some, because usually she may be waiting till tomorrow. Tomorrow's trash day. You know what? I don't know. I don't have a clue. I'm a nosy neighbor. I'm a nosy neighbor. GoPro stop recording. Well, dang. What? Are you just out walking or are you going somewhere? I'm just out walking. Dang. How much walking do you do? Five miles. Five miles? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I wish I could walk a mile. I'm trying to stay healthy. Huh? I'm trying to stay healthy. Well, it's a good time to do it, I'll tell you that. Instead of waiting until I did like I did. And now look. And I used to, I worked at Walmart for about two years and I did something called day maintenance and that was going around cleaning up spills and stuff, hazmat stuff. Yeah. I walked about seven miles a day on a shift. Wow. But that, 
I should have kept it up after I got out of there. Yeah. Yeah. What's your name? Pam. Pam? Well, my name's Russell. Russell. Matter of fact, let me give you one of my cards. Yeah, you gave me one. Huh? You gave me one of your cards. I have? Yeah, when I was out walking with my sister one day. When did I do that? Uh, I do that to everybody. Been few, it's been a few months ago now because my sister had come down and we were out walking. Yeah. I took her on the walk with me. Well, I got her to walk three miles. <laughs> I'm I'm thinking about getting my walker and walking around the dang block and see if that would help me. Uh, of course, with the walker, I see I can stop and sit down when my back starts. The walking don't bother me. It's the back starts. That's that's me. I got a bad back, and you know that's you know after my surgery, I start. Yeah. Saying, you need to walk, 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 walk. As long as I'm out walking, and I keep walking. But when I stop, that's when it starts. The pain starts. Mm hmm. Well, at least you're spread out, you know, you're covering a lot of different areas. Yeah, I, co yeah, I cover several subdivisions, and I go down to Publix, and mm -hmm. I circle around Publix. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm headed to the house, and I think you've been by my house a time or two. I'm not sure where you live. I, you know, I usually always pass you on the road. You know them there. big blue water tanks sitting on the corner over there? Over on 40... Uh, 40 40 seconds. Some water tank sits right there on the corner. My house is right now. I know I've seen you go down the street there. Okay. I'm, Been a while. I'm trying to think of the water tanks there. Well, you know the big water tank sticking up in the air? You've got to have seen that. That big huge one? The big one? Yeah. yeah. That's almost in my backyard. Oh, okay. That's where I live. Well, Derek, you have a good one, Pam. Thank you. You too. Have you, a good day. I'll see you later, dear. Not a very big one. Let's see what that is. Five thousand. I reckon that should go in Joey's room if they want. If they want it. We'll see when that girl leaves. Huh? I said, we'll see when that girl leaves. Oh, she's still here? Yep. We'll set this. Oh, yeah, let me turn it on. Set this over there on the porch somewhere. And then I need you. How heavy was that battery you picked up there? Pretty to heavy. To me, it wasn't heavy. It's bigger than normal. Um, 